It's kind of complicated, you guys. So try to stay with me when I explain this. Hello? Uh, yes, hello. Hello? Uh, yes, you called us. Did you call us? Uh, who's this? I don't know. This is computer technician, Alex. Oh, were you calling? Oh, you're calling about the computer? I wasn't working on it today, but are you from? It's not working with the computer. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah, uh, yeah. I'm from Windows of Microsoft. Oh, you're calling from Windows. Oh, um, I don't know. Yeah. We, I don't think we were we were looking to fix that last week, but um, I don't think I called today. We hadn't we hadn't fixed it yet, though. I don't know. Is that what you're calling about? Yes, we need to fix the computer because as we can see, there's something going wrong with your computer, so right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And somebody is somebody trying to misuse your computer and even you don't know where about that, you are my legitimate customer. That's why we give you call, okay, to check the computer. What's exactly going on? Oh, okay. So the computer will go ahead and work on it. Yeah. Are you the computer now? Um, I'm not with it. To, I'm not together with it right now, no. Um, it's so, a, how long is it going to take to, to be with the computer? Uh, well, I don't know. I don't know if they've legalized that yet, you know? So, you need to be in front of your computer. Uh, okay. Hold All right. On. Yeah, hold on. You have to see here. Right. Yeah. Hey, I grabbed it here. Yeah. Um, was it a hardware thing? I'm not really sure. I don't use this computer much, but... Um, uh, and who is the owner of the computer, sir? You are the only one person? Yeah, yeah. I usually am. I don't know. I'm usually what they'd call the admin, I guess. I use the admin login, whatever that you means, are, you know. Yes, <laughs> sure, yeah, all right. You are the admin login. I can understand. But the thing is that uh, somebody, mm -hmm. uh, do you know any anybody from different, different locations? They are just keep using the computer without your permission. Oh, I don't know. I Lots used the, the old connection. coffee shop one time and I let someone use it, but... That was more just for they had to send a quick email on it. Um, That's why we yeah. are wondering, and we'll go ahead and we have to work on the computer to fix it. To oh, recover do you need that person? Okay. I don't know who that was. It was just someone I had met in the coffee shop. Who person? And she needed to send an email. No, no, we don't need email. any person. We need to fix the computer only, Buzz. That I actually did not. I did end up getting her number, but um, I don't know if I want to give that out to you. You know. Yeah. And how many computers do you have? Oh, well, I just have this one. I have the tablet, and then I have the, um, I got the old 86 in the back. <laughs> That's in the back. And all room, of you those, know? Is, <laughs> yeah, yeah. all of those is connected to the same internet connection, correct? Uh, I'm pretty sure, yeah. We used to have the old 14.4 going for a while, um, but we upgraded recently. Okay. Um, yeah. So we're now on the, uh, we're now on the wireless, I guess it is. It's some kind of satellite system so or something, right? Computers, no, I don't, we don't need it. Computers on now? Yeah, the computer's on, but I don't know if the satellite's on, too. I don't know. We have to turn that on, too, right, to get the internet? Or so, All right. So do one thing. Let me take it out. Just do one do thing. Do you see okay. the Windows key on? Well, I, let me turn do it on. Do you see the here. Windows? Hold on just a sec. Okay, it says preparing to configure Windows. Do not turn off computer. All right, and how many percentage it has been complete? Doesn't say any percent. It's just got the little circle going, you know. So should I should I jump outside? Oh, it says thirty five percent now. Oh, there it goes. As it is. Should I log into the, the app? What? Yeah, well, you turn should the log computer in. On? Should, I'll turn it no, off. No, I'm Hold telling you, leave as it is. I'm telling you, leave this computer as it is. All right. Oh, the additives. I don't know. I haven't. I don't have any ports added on or anything. I do have an external okay. hard how drive, many, though. Yes. Um, how, how many percentage have you done right now? Oh, I turned it off. You told me to turn it off. Should I restart it then, or? Yeah, restart it. I pressed the power button and held that to turn it off. You know. Mm-hmm. Uh, hold on. Let me start it. Yeah. Okay. It's not giving me that configure message anymore. Was computer that... is on now? No, it's turning on, but it's not giving me that configure message anymore. Do I need to restart it again to configure it? No, 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 no. To... Leave as it is. Don't no. need to restart. Do I have to find that email she sent is what the problem was? You, or you don't... 
I can't you I don't, don't know. need it's to find the email. In, I don't think it's in the inbox anymore. I probably archived it. Or I guess that was on her account, so I wouldn't don't. even have the email, right? Let me tell you, sir. Just listen to me. Don't do anything. Just don't, follow don't my instructions. Do anything, what I'm okay. telling you. Okay. Look at your keyboard. Do you see the Windows key on your keyboard? The Windows key. Just like the flag key at the bottom. Oh, that's corner. right by the free network key, right? The FN key. That's what FN. we used to log onto the yeah, internet yeah, yeah. or onto our free internet, free network. I th think that's what that button was. <laughs> No one ever told me when I was setting up the computer, but I thought that was for, you know. FN means function fee. F, yeah. It's for the free network, FN. You have to press Windows key and the letter R together. Uh, it says open calc. Oh, I haven't used calc in a while. <laughs> yeah, just make it clear. Calculator, that's come with calculator. Just delete okay. that. Yeah, make just, it clear. Yeah, it just says zero in that. There's not the memory going or whatever. I don't think. Um, just type what I'm telling you. Just type over there. www dot. I, I it only has numbers, unless I change it to the scientific calculator. I think. I'm telling you, just make it clear. Just clear the C it A L C. Is, it is clear. clear. It. It is clear. It just says zero. And. and it doesn't have close any, that one, sir. I'm telling you, close your any, calculator. Uh, First of all, close your calculator. Oh, close the calculator. Okay, it's just on the desktop now. Just press Windows key and letter R. Windows and R. Right, this is what I just did, right, with the calc? Don't go to the calc. Right? If the calc is written over there, if the calc is written over there, make it clear. Oh, make just it clear. Just clear the box. Well, now it says CMD in the box. I pressed the little arrow. Yeah, just delete I pressed it. the little arrow down, and now it says CMD delete in the it. box. Make, just empty the box. Make oh, it okay. clear. There okay. should be no any. Um, okay. Uh, CMD.exe. There's a little black box now. It says um, Microsoft ver uh, Windows version 1.3.3.7. I don't you don't this, have usually. to type over there. Can you open the Google? Just open the Google. Open the Google. Okay. Is that dot com or dot net these days? I don't know. Dot com. Dot com. It says www.google.com is not recognized as an internal or external command. I'm telling you, operable you don't program have to type or batch over. file. Hello, hello. Yes, yes. Are you crazy? You're not listening. To me. I'm telling what? you, just close command prompt and open the Google Chrome. Do you have the internet? Google Chrome. That sounds fancy. I don't know. I don't know what that is. We need to. Yeah, if you want to fix the computer, we need to fix the computer, and there is one time charge mm -hmm. for the fixing of your computer, right? Oh, what's wrong with the computer? It has to do those uh, updates. The, yeah, yeah. We need to update the security because we don't have any securities right now. Okay. It it just said updating. Well, I when I turned the computer on though, it was at thirty five percent. No, we told me to, to turn the computer off, so I did. Updating is different thing. I'm telling you, you don't have any active security on your computer, sir. Okay? Oh, that is a shame. I thought we did. Um, the problem is that you don't have any security right now on the computer, right? I don't know. Apparently, is not yeah. why you is not yeah. why you called, right? Yes, that's why we called you to go ahead and upgrade the security on your computer. Oh, upgrade that, it from you, from past thirty yeah. thirty five percent. It has to go all the way to one hundred percent. No, I guess. that is the different thing. For the security, there is one time registration charge. Okay. A one time what now? Registration charge. Oh, registration. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you have to make the payment, and we'll install it on for, for your computer. Oh, you, through the satellite, then, I guess. We have to patch that in or something? Yeah, yeah. Or? Yeah. So don't use the satellite. I'll let you know once we install don't security. Don't use the satellite. If you want. Okay. I don't know how else I if would you get, want, on the, I'll go. get on the internet without the satellite, though. That must be yeah. connected to your satellite at, at uh, Microsoft, I guess? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, so, which plan do you like to go ahead? Do you want for the short time period or for the long time period? Well, what's the difference? 
Yeah, we install the securities under your name, and for the one year cost will be uh, two forty nine, and for the five year the cost will be three ninety nine ninety nine. Oh, for the five year you're starting to see some savings at five year, right? Yeah. Okay. Could do a little regression analysis on that. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Let's, Which one? Let's go ahead and go do the five year then. Um, I don't know if it'll let. I don't know how long I'm going to have this computer, hopefully into the foreseeable future, but. Yeah, yeah. So, you know. Could you confirm your name? Yeah, it's Jason. Well, you're Jason, J A S R N Jason? Yes, correct. Your last name? Uh, source Kid. Let's spell it out S O U R S C H O D E. Source code? And I don't, no, it's source kid. You know, like Peter Source Kid? I'm not related to him, but <laughs> What's you know, your email? You know the actor? It's Jason S one nine seven seven at Yahoo dot com. Jason S S like uh your last S like Source right? Good, yes, yes. Uh one nine seven seven at Yahoo dot com. Which browser do you have? Um, Internet Explorer. Yeah, open the Thanks Internet Explorer. Internet Let's Explorer open yeah. yeah, open the Internet yeah. Explorer. People have been telling me to upgrade to Navigator recently, and I don't know. I haven't gotten around to don't, that don't yet. Don't have... But... Sir, Paul, let me connect your computer, okay? Yeah, it's already, so connected. Internet it's already connected. I'm on yeah. Yahoo email right I'm now. I'm going to connect you your know. computer right now. It's it's I'm already going connected, to connect... sir. You're not listening to me. Oh. I'm telling you, yeah. I'm going to connect your computer to my server. Just follow my instructions. Yes. On Internet Explorer, just type uh -huh. www. Dot. Is this not in my email here? I'm telling you, close your email. Don't you open the email, follow my instructions. Just close the email browser. Yeah, close your email. Okay, I'm back on the desktop Don't go to the now. Email. Back on the desktop. And open here. Internet Explorer. Just open your Internet Explorer. Oh, Internet Explorer. www.yahoo.com slash yeah, make it clear. Just slash delete mail that dot telnet. That's the address it says Correct. there. Just make it oh, clear. Oh, yes, telnet. Okay. Make it clear. Uh, yeah. Uh, Just clear it. Clear it. And at that at that box just type www dot okay yeah okay support dot me support dot me you oh i'm trying to i mean we're trying to get this resolved i S guess yeah, yeah. just type s u p p o r t support dot me oh type i'm trying to support you sir but I don't know if I'm using you have, the right browser. Are you crazy? You have to type on the browser. This is the address bar. Just type this build site on your address bar. Okay? Support.me. What? Is that a website though? I don't know. It's not .com or anything. Support.me and then hit enter. This is the, I thought Yahoo was .com and the other ones were as well. Um, so this is... No, what can you see right now? Just tell me. Says rescue by log me in. Do you see support connection? Yeah, it's, it says rescue by log me in, and then there's a support connection. Click on it. Yes, if they enter six digit code, do you see that? Uh, yes, I do. Just put the code. The code is eight three four three five one. And what is this for? Is this the security we are going that to, I'm downloading right yeah, now? This is, yeah, this is the security which we are going to install on the computer. Oh, it's called Rescue by Log Me In? I guess I don't have to log into that then. No. Now, what can you see? Did you download the so Did you download it? No? Uh, no, you haven't. You didn't send it to me yet. Do you need me to go back to the Yahoo email? No, you, you have on, to go. Do you see support connection? Yahoo. Talk. Do you see that? Yeah, that's on the I other page. Yeah. What, what was that? Uh, what? Nothing. Hello? Yeah, that's on the other page. I'm talking to someone else. Oh, you are? Okay. Yeah, that's on the other page. 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 Ye
Do you see support connection page and did you put your code over there? Uh, 834351. Yes. Click a start download. Okay. Now, now can I check no, my email? On? Is it sending to that now? I'll go check that. No, no, I don't need to check your email. Well, isn't that what it's downloading? I want... Right? Isn't that what the... Uh, the, uh, uh, what? Some days old, I, I don't know. Well, that guy sure took his sweet time catching on. Damn shame. Maybe you should have patched me in through the satellite. Microsoft does not call you to tell you about problems with your computer or about needing to upgrade or install some kind of security. All these people are scammers. Thanks for watching everyone, be sure to hit that like button if you enjoyed me wasting this asshole scammer's time, and I'll be seeing you next time. Cheers.